What is Web 3.0? Web 3.0 is the product of technological and conceptual innovation of the times. The development of blockchain technology and the popularization of the concept of data ownership are the critical fuse that triggers the web revolution and the innovation of ideas, which guides the development and application of technology. So, what new business models will Web 3.0 bring? The Web 3.0 network essentially serves data, and data will be the foundation of all business models, in which data ownership and data identity are vital factors. The fanatical DAO airdrop is generally based on the historical data of user wallet address interaction, including gas fees, currency holding, transfer, pledge, mining and many other dimensions. Individuals own these data, and everyone in the blockchain industry agrees. In the Web 2.0 network framework, social accounts also record the total interactive data such as shopping, wealth management transfers, and loans. Still, no one has ever obtained benefits through this information. Because a social account is only an account of a particular platform, the platform can block your account at any time. Trump is no exception. So I suggest that Trump consider registering a decentralized account through Jasmine because in the Web 3.0 network, the SG distributed identity system developed by Jasmine can ensure that no one can ban a speech account. Under the Web 2.0 framework, users are powerless to resist, and data-based business models are only exploiting users. Because morality and law are full of holes, in front of interests, the establishment of data ownership can only be guaranteed at the technical level. The manifestation of value is based on the establishment of ownership, just like land, houses, items, and money is all the same for thousands of years. The ownership also reflects the value of data in the Web 3.0 network era, because only by returning the ownership of data to users, allowing users to control their data, realize data interoperability under the premise of ensuring security will allow users have the right to speak and formulate rules in business, which is the basis for making data valuable. During the development of JASME, the solution to data security problems was first proposed and commercialized. The first core product, JASME Secure PC, was officially released on November 5, 2021. On the JASME platform, for individual users, not only you can store and manage critical personal data in the JASME data cabinet, but you also can freely decide whether to provide personal data to the company and conduct data tracking management. Under the Web 3.0 network framework, the trend of enterprise DAO is unstoppable. Both enterprises and users will follow unified guidelines, data will be stored in a distributed manner, and data security and ownership will be guaranteed through data identity and privacy computing technologies. There is also interoperability, data identity. In this way, the business model based on data ownership has unlimited room for imagination. Jasmine can provide distributed digital identity did, decentralized identity, allowing users to own and control their own digital identity. Did contains the user's identity information and private data, which can only be used with the user's authorization, and has the characteristics of security, verifiability, and interoperability. The did system realizes the discovery, identification and verification of identity in a decentralized manner, without relying on the audit and permission of the centralized identity system. Obviously, did identity is just a simple case to illustrate the situation? The whole framework system is to be, in a trust-minimized environment, individuals and businesses will be able to interact on a completely new framework, without relying on intermediary structures. Here is a classic case, an asset leasing company in Japan, in the process of expanding overseas markets, there is a gap in business data with overseas customers, which hinders business development. So rental companies install sensors on each machine, uploading data on each machine's revenue to the cloud. But the contradiction is that because it is a cross-border service, and there are multiple layers of intermediaries, the data provided in the end cannot be guaranteed to be accurate, and users still do not trust the company. The data of party A and party B do not agree with each other, resulting in trust problems. This is a common problem in business models under the Web 2.0 framework. As a result, Data identification hinders business development. Under the Web 3.0 framework, Jasmine can provide a third-party solution for verifying the authenticity of data. The third party can be a miner. Third parties do not directly offer accurate data, but only provide channels to audit and verify data when needed. In the future, you will find that such a similar case is just a microcosm of the Web 3.0 framework. When the Web 3.0 network travels a certain scale, as mentioned above, in the scenario where everyone uses the same standard ID, 
When companies and users conduct a series of business activities such as asset transactions, business cooperation, investment, leasing, shopping, etc., only the A and B parties need to disclose the necessary cooperation data information, just like the transaction data on the wallet address, which is true and cannot be tampered with, everyone will agree with. Web 3.0 will create more diverse ways of interaction and break down the barriers of interaction on a global scale. Jasmine uses cryptography to connect data from individuals, enterprises and machines with efficient machine learning algorithms to create a new market and business model.